how difficult is it to actually put a whole season of curriculum together and how many people are required to do that? Um, well, it, it was, it's getting easier now that we've kind of got the system in place to do it. Initially, it was very difficult because, uh, you know, it's a process to develop and really take time to hear what God really wants in the curriculum. You know, there's all kinds of ideas that come at you. And um, so that took a little over a year to just flesh out, you know, what the three lessons would be, mm -hmm. the themes and the, uh, the scope and sequence for, for those lessons for the first year. Um, and now uh, it, it's a team of about, um, I guess, a little over 10 people. You know, you've got uh, a writer and an editor that, you know, really spend all their time just kind of developing the lessons. There's a whole other group of people that have already written the scripts for the episodes and produced all of those episodes. Right. I mean, that's a whole different group. Right. But, uh, but once the episodes are done, and then we have a, um, a producer that just does the Bible background, the signpost script, and we have a script writer. And then Academy is a digital product, and so we have a team of people that have developed the website where you can go get Superbook Academy mm -hmm. and how they put all the courses into the material and uh, into the uh, online uh, format. So, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a big group of people. Well, on behalf of all the thousands of churches in Indonesia that are using Superbook Academy, um, I would like to say thank you mm -hmm. for it, to you and your team for all the hard work, sweat, blood, and tears that you've poured into it. And um, we would just love it if you just look right over at that camera and wave to all the Sunday school teachers out there. <laughs> And, and um, thank you from all of us. Yeah, and thank for you using. for using the curriculum. Yeah. I mean, uh, that is, it's just amazing that, to see how many people are um, using it. And it, it wouldn't be possible if it wasn't people out there that were actually taking the time to spend with the kids and just feeling it their mission in life to uh, talk to kids and tell them about, and then teach them and disciple them. So you guys are the ones doing the work, not us. Weren't you a Sunday school teacher, or don't you teach Sunday school? I did. I raised three kids and taught a lot of Sunday school. Even before my kids were born, when I was still in uh, grad school, I was teaching Sunday school on the weekends. So yeah, I spent a lot of time in Sunday school. <laughs> so. Okay, thank you. God bless you. Bye-bye.